What is up guys, Kevin over at Lake Rose coming back at you with another video finally. Sorry I've been away for a couple days. You just ran out of stock. I didn't have any hauls to go through and I couldn't think of an idea to do. Uh, so we do have two things to go through. These are very small and the purpose of this video mainly, not because of these, uh, is just that I wanted to start a uh, kind of an ask a reseller segment uh, for an upcoming video here. So. What I'd like you to do, obviously, subscribe first if you're new here. Uh, welcome. Become a leg bro. So hit that subscribe button, smash the like button. And of course, uh, underneath the comments below, I'd like you just to just ask me a question. If you guys have any uh, questions about the Lego reselling world, any questions about me specifically in terms of life in general, how I do things, uh, just ask anything in that uh, comment section below on this video, and then I will do a follow-up video answering all of those questions. I think that could be a good video series to uh, kind of go in between when I don't have hauls specifically, because I'd like to come out you guys with some content, uh, you know, not when I when I have dead times, because sometimes you just can't order things. <laughs> I think uh, there's a conspiracy now that I'm thinking that a lot of my viewers now are buying the stuff that I would normally buy. <laughs> so. Uh, we have some good stuff coming in though, so stay tuned. Uh, if you're new here, obviously, you don't know what's in store for you, but just wait. Smash that subscribe button, push the bell, and then you'll find out. Uh, so this first one here is just a simple little set here. Very, very good packaging. We have, you know, I like the old sets. We have an old Mtron set, and they actually put uh, packaging in the box and everything like that as well. Looks like the flap on the box, unfortunately, is missing, which is kind of unfortunate. Um, but I was looking for one of these boxes specifically um, to, because I have a, a sealed bag. Uh, so I'll put an open box sealed bag, I think, in that one. Uh, and then, of course, we have the set. We also have the insert um, from the old set as well. That was the instructions. And then we also have, I believe, I don't know if this is a poster, but it might be it's kind of a, a mini mini poster of sorts. Oh man, so cool. This was original Blacktron and original Space Police right here. Crazy. I don't think this would, it doesn't make sense that this would be the insert in there because Mtron was after all of this. That's interesting. I'll have to look into that. Um, but yeah, I loved when they did all these old scenes. You can tell there was a Lego builder who had to build all of this stuff because this is just actually a picture. This isn't actually digitally done or anything like that. They actually made all of this and <laughs> put the picture. We have the uh, monorail, the old monorail from, uh, that's what, Explorians or uh, is it Futuron. That's what it is. It says, of course, it says right there. <laughs> uh, Futuron, some Futuron sets, the old, old Space Police. Uh, I've always wanted this, so that is definitely on my list to look for. Haven't found it under like 200 bucks, 150 to 200 bucks lately, so uh, that's going to be hard <laughs> to get a steal on that one uh, because I usually need to get things remarkably cheap. Oh man, I'm never going to be able to get this back together. Oh well, I'll look into that. <laughs> I'll look into that later. Uh, but you can see. Oh no, oh no, disaster. Well, now I'm gonna have to inventory this. I mean, I was going to anyway, but <laughs> I definitely have to now. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just did that. I had no idea that the bag was, I I was about to say I had no idea the bag was open and I realized that I opened the bag. Oh my gosh. Okay, yep, one take videos, folks. <laughs> one, one take. One take videos. It's classic. <laughs> just classic. Oh my gosh. And this next one uh, is actually just a little tiny thing as well. Like I said, this is just going to be a short video. Uh, mostly I just wanted to come at you guys with something and get you to comment below a question for me. Uh, as we can see, some bright blue here. This is a figure I haven't had in quite some time. It's not complete. So I will have to complete it. Uh, but here we have the old school Watto. It looks like he has his original drill here as well. Um, but definitely not the correct, you know, pieces here on him. Really what you're looking for is just this torso though, uh, or sorry, the head print, uh, the head mold, because uh, it is a unique mold and this is the only one they did it in for these, this old Watto. And he is going, I think for like 60, $60 plus now. Uh, once he's complete. So I will complete him uh, and that will make a fine addition. <laughs> right now he'll go in the the bin of uh, figures that are expensive to be complete. I showed this on a live stream the other day. Uh, I'm gonna have to order some pieces to complete some of these figures that are all pretty good in value. Um, 
But yeah, that should make a fine addition to that bin. <laughs> While I order some stuff, you can see his torso is cracked too. But really all I wanted was just this. So uh, that's all I was after at that point. It could have been it could have been just this and I would have paid the same. I think I paid $25 uh, for this one. Uh, just an auction that no one else bid on. So that works. <laughs> I'll complete him and, and make a, a pretty good profit there. Uh, so we'll put him in with the... Uh, the things to be completed and uh, comment below again uh, what you want to ask me anything about life anything about reselling anything about lego anything about whatever you'd like just comment below on this video smash the like button for the youtube got the youtube algorithm so that this video goes out to more people so we get more questions and then we'll do a follow-up video and stay tuned man i got some i got some stuff i'm not going to go short on video content if everything comes in as planned uh, I spent a pretty penny. <laughs> Again, I can't be stopped. Somebody help me. I need help. <laughs> it's one of those videos where it's like blink twice uh, if you need help. So yes, comment below. Love all of you who have subscribed already. We're almost at 2,800. Uh, so we might actually be at 2,800 by the time this video goes up. Who knows? Um, my YouTube video uh, about how much I made on YouTube, go ahead and check that out as well. That video is totally tanking for some reason. I thought it would do really, really well. Um, but unfortunately... I don't know if it just didn't get out to people, if it didn't get notified, uh, but it's doing a lot worse than the other videos. So go ahead and look at that if you haven't. It's the last video that's posted right before this one. Go ahead and check that out. I went over how much I made uh, in YouTube over the last few months with, you know, once you hit that thousand subscriber mark. Uh, and I go into in-depth in the analytics. If you guys are thinking about making a YouTube channel, it gives you some inf information there uh, that you might you know want to consider if you're actually looking into that. Uh, as a possible side business or anything to that effect. So uh, with that said, I'm rambling now at this point. I love you all, and I'll catch you on the next one.